purpose of art is both to embody the myths and to break through them. What a work of art does is touch you in a place that nothing else does, and I do believe that it changes you. I'm on the board of the Friends of the Freedom Theater, which is a theater that's in the Janine refugee camp. And they wrote a play about the siege of the Church of the Nativity in um, Bethlehem in 1998 from the point of view of the uh, freedom fighters who were inside the church. And there was, as you can imagine, an enormous amount of pushback. But in the end, the play was about six young men in this church. One of the characters uh, talked about being afraid and he was the character that in the West most people uh, attached to. In Palestine, a lot of people objected to that character because he wasn't, uh, he didn't um, kind of fulfill the myth of a uh, freedom fighter. So that we see that everywhere people have uh, myths and if nothing else, what the audience members discovered were that they were human beings. Even if their political view of the uh, Israeli occupation hasn't changed, at least we'll understand that all the people involved in this discussion are human beings and that's where we must go from. Uh, and that's what we can do, I think, as artists.